It is really scary when you find out that you need to have back surgery. It is so scary. And you think you're the only person. Because people don't talk about it. We hear about heart, we hear about cancer, but where is spine? Where is spine? And it's the number one cause of disability. Sort of having those injuries around those discs, that's like really serious and the pain is excruciating and just feeling a little bit helpless. It felt like it came out of left field. There were quite a few days that I would just keep to myself because I hurt. The miracles of modern spinal health care are giving people options like never before. How do you find those resources? What questions do you even ask your doctor? How do you even know what to ask for? The National Spine Health Foundation has built a medical and scientific board comprised of 50 of the nation's top spine experts. I'm really pleased to be uh, uh, have an opportunity to be part of the board of the National Spine Health Foundation. I'm really, truly honored to be part of the National Spine Health Foundation. I think it's so important that patients have a voice. I see uh, this foundation really providing immense value to patients. And there's a lot of misinformation out there that sort of adds to the fear. My hat's off to the organization here, both for providing uh, information to patients that uh, the patients need and in a forum that is understandable. The diagnostic and the treatment elements of spine are so complicated. That's why we have experts like folks on this panel. And you guys are providing a, a medium by which people can get real information. These surgeons are giving you their time, their knowledge, their insight through Spine Talks so that you can access the top leaders in spine, right from the comfort of your own home. Anytime we can improve anyone's quality of life with people who are invested in that type of care, I'm on board. We can't do this alone. We need to build networks of supporters, industry, individuals, doctors, spine societies, healthcare societies, insurers, hospital systems. They all have a part to play in helping us help patients get better. There are a lot of snake oil salesmen out there, and so that's why I think what you guys are doing is so important. Um, we know how to help you get better so that you can either avoid surgery or be better prepared for surgery. We have patients post out that play golf, play tennis, snow ski, water ski, but even after major scoliosis surgery. So uh, it's really an exciting future. The larger the surgery that's proposed, the better you should feel about the relationship with the people that are treating you. Because it's a long-term relationship. And I think empowering patients to participate in an informed choice is a really big goal of, of the program you're providing. and We're happy to contribute to that. When you give to the National Spine Health Foundation, you help people get back to their lives.